welcome. Uh, today is uh, first day of spring, actually. Uh, the equinox just passed a few hours ago, and I'm here in Austin, and it's gorgeous already, of course. Um, and I'm about to do a live class on my Powhouse house site, but I thought I'd do a real quick spring video with you guys, just kind of a nice spring flow, getting your body moving, getting warmed up from all the cold, from all the winter and everything. So just real quick, let's start here at the front of your mat where you are, palms together at your heart. Feel your foundation, kind of move a little back and forth. And then let your knees bend, let your body soften. Everything come towards the ground as we neutralize first. Total neutralization, relaxing everything completely. Good, now notice the way when you neutralize, you automatically get that kind of bowspring effect of your sits bones wide. We're gonna bend our knees so that we get that grounding wave. Take a deep breath in. As you exhale, keep the sits bones wide, press down, exhale, and continue to push down, grounding wave rolling up over the psoas. Psoas wave and then lumbar continues to lengthen out extension and then arms up to express, and he'll reach up. Bend your knees, exhale, fold it all the way down. Good. Wave now halfway long. Fingers can be on shins. Get your spine nice and flat, best you can. Good, then fingers down, step your right foot back. <laughs> Bring your knee to the ground. Knee softly down, point your toes. Take a deep breath. Again, we ground, soften, exhale, begin to roll it up along the front of your spine. Lumbar, elbows, bend, arms to the sky. Take a deep breath, stretch. Reach it up, good. Exhale, bring it back down. Fingers, knuckles, palms. From there, ground, tuck your back toes and shoot your left leg back up to the sky. Keep reaching up there, nice and long. Get a stretch, take a deep breath. Exhale, bend everything. Knees, elbows, scoop in, knee to nose. Push the floor away. Step your left foot to left thumb. Wave your spine long. Good, this time we're gonna maybe just bend our back knee a little bit. Again, soften, neutralize, inhale. Exhale, push down, roll it up soft and slow. Roll up and then continue lengthening arms up, inhale. Exhale, bend it back, squeeze up from your pelvic floor. A little fist of fire, inhale, reach up. Exhale, squeeze it up. Use that powerful breath from your pelvic floor, squeezing up to your belly. Nice, now tilt forward, hi ladybug. Wave your spine long, inhale, reach out. Open your mouth, tongue out, express out all that old energy. <sighs> Good, now careful here, bend your back knee. Again, roll it up mindfully. Then feel your arms up, legs up, our, uh, breath up and inhale. Let it go. <sighs> Good, one more time, roll up. Deep breath in, fill up, stretch up. Let it go, express out. <sighs> Good. From there, fingers softly come back to the floor. Let's let our left leg go a little straighter. It doesn't have to go all the way straight, but begin to play your edge nice and smart. Can you keep your sits bones fairly even now? Keep widening them back as we ground that energy up along the inseams of our legs, lengthening back long, deep in your breath, and softly fold. Beautiful, now bend your front knees, step both feet to the front of your mat. Bring your big toes close together. Bend your knees even deeper, sits bones back. Again, deep breath in, prepare. Grounding wave pushes through Y wave, Keep that wying of your sits bones and exhale, roll up the psoas. Keep lifting, lengthening nice and long. Unfurl your arms up as the lumbar matches it. Sit down nice and deep there. Take a full breath in. Exhale, fold all the way down, relax again. Play your legs straighter. Wave spine long, inhale. Exhale, fold. Now left foot steps all the way back. Bring your knee down, right knee over right ankle. Put your toes if you want, either way. Let's ground and feel our sits bones spread wide apart as we inhale. Keep that grounding, exhale pushing down, rolls up along the front of the spine, then inhale, unfurls, stretch it up. Beautiful. Get a nice stretch there through fingertips, arms long. Exhale, let's let our fingertips come back down. Set your gecko asana, mindfully set hands. Tuck your back toes and shoot your right foot all the way back up behind you. Take a deep breath as you stretch up. With exhale, we're gonna bend everything, elbows and knees, scoop knee to nose, push the earth away, lift your hips up, step right foot to right thumb, spine waves long. I step my back foot in just about two inches or an inch, not very much, but bend your back knee. This allows hips to stay square, rolling up from that super stable hip area with your widening sit bones, then roll it up all the way, and then push the leg a little straighter. Take a deep breath in, stretch up. Exhale, squeeze up, fists of fire heart open. Inhale, wave up, unfurl. Exhale, squeeze. Inhale. Exhale. Good. Tilt your pelvis forward. Inhale, reach out. Open mouth, tongue out, express it out. Good. Bend the back knee, roll up mindfully. Inhale, fill up deeper and let it go. 
One more time. Roll up, fill your lungs up, and express it out. Very nice. Now, fingers to the floor. Let's let our right leg start to push a little straighter now. Feel your right sits bone go up and back. Left sits bones as well. Continues to lengthen and just fold over the leg for a few breaths. Deepening into the breath. Relax your neck and face and jaw. Let's get a nice stretch here for a moment. Then we'll re-bend the front knee. Bend your back knee like a spring. Hop the feet to the front of your mat. Bend your knees, sit back. Feel that Y wave. Inhale deeply. Exhale, keep the Y wave, but activate your psoas. Activate the lumbar and then extend, lengthen up high. Sit your body deep into that chair. Really get into it. Continue actively. Psoas wave, tilting the pelvis up and in. Arms up towards the sky, stretch out. Take a deep breath in. And let's fold all the way down. Oh, relax here a moment. Just sway a little side to side. Good. Now wave halfway up and inhale. Exhale, bring it down. Step back, foot, right foot. Knee to the ground. Maybe wave up to the sky. Fill your lungs. Exhale, bring it back to the earth. Set your hands mindfully. Tuck your back toes. Left leg shoots back up behind you. Inhale. Bend everything. Exhale, scoop forward. Knee to nose. Push the floor away. Step foot to thumb. Turn your back foot out and walk everything around to the other side. We do a little sway, a little seed body there. I'm going to turn around for you, but notice your feet about even, sort of parallel. Sway yourself out there. Come to center. Bend your knees a lot. Get that firm bowspring sensation in your bum, those sits bones wide. Inhale. Exhale, start to squeeze up from the front of your pubic bones, softly, slowly, moving up lumbar, so as, and then up towards the sky. Beautiful. Hands back on our hips. I'm going to set this up. We're constructing a pose here. So turning your left toes. So for me, I'll do the right side. Left toes forward. Let your back heel lift and set it back. So back leg is lengthening. Let's build your own warrior pose. Then hands begin to swivel your hips a little bit forward, but not too much. Just barely kind of finding that natural, natural connection with the back leg. Then arms back to the sky. Swivel your torso. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, release hands back behind us. Interlace your fingers. Stretch your knuckles down. Fill your lungs up. Tilt forward. Shift your weight forward. Lift your back heel. And see if you can slowly come over the tops of your toes. Shift out to warrior three. Back leg floats. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, let's re-bend. Bend your back knee. Roll to the sky. Good. Take a deep breath. Roll it up. Exhale, palms to chest and twist to the left side. Hook your elbow. Anytime you want, back knee can come down or back leg lifted. Press your palms, twisting, maybe gaze up. Take a deep breath. Good. Exhale, let's release fingertips back to the floor. Ground here. Shoot back. Find yourself in a plank pose. Straight line with your body. Good. Notice your pelvis never dropping. We keep that powerful psoas support. Inhale. Knees down if you want. Exhale, lower down. Pubic first, shoulders back. Point your toes. Inhale. Exhale, squeeze up. Elbows in. Heart open. Cobra. Lift your heart. Gaze up. And then come halfway down. Lift from your psoas. Back to the down dog. Very nice. Spread the fingers wide. Maybe feet together. Bend elbows and knees. Inhale. Gaze forward. Exhale. Maybe a few hops. Maybe when you're ready. You float yourself forward between your hands. Wave long. Inhale. Exhale, fold. Let it all go. Good. Bend your knees. Take a deep breath. Do that Y wave as you exhale. Roll up so as. Lumbar lengthening all the way up. Stretch and heel. Bend your knees. Exhale, fold it down. Good. Wave halfway. And then step left foot all the way back. Knee to the ground. Can you wave up here? Get a nice arch opening. And then fingertips set back down. From there, ground your hands. Shoot your right foot up to the sky. Deep breath in, bend everything, scoop forward into nose, push the earth away, step foot to thumb, wave your spine long. Now, hands walk out to the left. So again, let your feet turn so they become parallel. We're close to it. Maybe sway a little bit around there, kind of ninja lunge it out. Come back to a stable place, bend your knees. Grounding wave sets up that Y wave, take a deep breath. Exhale, start to roll in from the psoas. Lumbar activates, and then we get that extension. From there, hands on our hips. This time we turn our right toes forward. Let your left heel angle back. Back leg grows long. 
hips naturally kind of move forward. Get a nice little stretch. Keep your front knee over your front ankle, and then arms up. Let your torso continue swiveling forward. Getting a warrior one. Take a deep breath. Exhale, drop your hands behind interlace. Stretch knuckles down. Fill your lungs up through collarbones. Exhale, tilting forward. Begin to lift your back heel and start to slowly shift weight over the toes. Float yourself up at your own pace. Warrior three. A couple breaths here. Go as flat as you can. Beautiful, guys. Slowly return toes to the floor. Wave arms up to the sky. Exhale, bring your hands to the earth. Flow back into plank again, straight line, inhale. Maybe knees down or chaturanga, either way. But bring your pubic down first. Point your toes, shoulders back. Exhale, lift out, cobra or up dog. Inhale, fill up. And then release it back to down dog. So nice. Take a deep breath, really full breath in here, fill up. Open your mouth, tongue out, express it out. <laughs> Getting rid of all the little toxin. Knees come to the ground. Sit your hips back on your heels. So that was a nice little warming up for the new energy of the new springtime. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you got a nice little opening in yourself to release out all that old stored toxins and negative energy from the winter time. Thank you for joining me so much. And if you want to check out some of my full courses and all the op other new stuff that I have available, you can check it out on my Powhow site, powhow.com slash classes slash Tyler Yoga Studio. So I hope to see you soon. Have a great day. Happy spring. Namaste.